travel. Right? We are. Good morning, guys. We are up and out, and it is not even 6 a.m. We are going riding. So, no, we are in a massive heat wave, and we can't drive. We can't ride. We can't ride, and it's the only way we can ride is if we get to the barn before the heat. So, we are racing to the barn like every time. We are racing to the barn for real. We were hoping to be there at 5 30. Yeah, we suck. Right, you guys? Let's do this. No, I just want to say hello. I love when they're like standing there, pick me, pick me. <laughs> Storm waved. Gabby waved to Storm and he shook his head back and forth. Hello. <laughs> and, says, and Stella doesn't know to come to us yet. Hello, Stella. And oh, that's the new horse, you guys. She's like, I want to go. Oh, wow. You know what, that happens to every single horse when they're new here. You see she's standing out by herself because she's all alone. And whenever they're adjusting to the new herd, they're always like, want their humans. Oh she's pretty. Oh, she's so pretty. I love the white feet. Oh, she's a sure pony. That's gonna suck. You're, she's a pony, isn't she cute? No, yeah. what's her name? Grace. Yeah. Oh, see, I said Grace and she shook it. She's no, like, I'm coming out. She's tiny. Thank you. Hello, um, Grace. She's a pretty girl. Your ribs, but look, it's look. A lot fatter than most. Storm's like, whoa, oh, he's just looked away now. He's like, don't pick me. I don't oh. want to go. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Oh, you know. look at that little girl. She's following Gabby everywhere. She didn't have any friends yet. And then over there is Mean Girl 1 and Mean Girl 2. No, I'm just kidding. She's like, that's what I know. So we're here super early, beating the heat. It's already starting to get hot. Uh, they haven't eaten yet because um, chores happen a little bit later. So they usually have breakfast a little bit later than it is right now. We don't want to ride them on an empty belly. I know you're not supposed to feed your horse before you ride, but they should. It's been a while since they had some grass. So um, we're giving them, so our instructor told us to let them have a little bit of grazing before we ride, just a few minutes. We're gonna brush them out here, let them have a little bit of a breakfast. And then it won't be a hard ride anyway. It's just too hot, too hot to do anything. I know a lot of you guys are doing that. I forgot to say happy 4th of July to you guys from um, the States yesterday. That's terrible of me, but happy 4th of July. It's probably already two days now, <laughs> two days ago. I wanted to get that scab off. Gabby, bring me the bug spray. Yeah, Stella doesn't care about the bugs. Mr. Storm does though. Um, now that we have Stella, I feel like Storm is too skinny. Yeah, he looks good, but he's just skinny compared to her. Oh, you know, this makes me sad, you guys. Remember all the times when 
Remember all the times when, aww, uh, Storm and Sabrina were out here? I almost forgot her name there for a second. Yeah, bugs are bad. We know. We know all about it. This is the fun part. The girth. This is like bathing suit shopping. I have stopped making fat jokes about our Stella though because people are starting to get upset. She doesn't care though. Do you care? Here, let me help. It's like pony club. It's like a pony club. Anyway. <laughs> Molly's riding bareback. She's bouncing around like a crazy girl. Anyway, so we're using, we're borrowing a girth for Stella until she loses a little bit of weight so we don't have to buy five million girths. But yeah, that's not gonna work because she puffs up her belly so the girth that barely fits her does not fit her and I don't have the strength to pew, pull it up. So it took us forever to get that girl saddled. She's so forgiving though. We're all set. Stella's like, let's get moving. There you go, slide your saddle over a tiny bit. There we go, you have to do that all the time, don't forget, because she's... Oh, she's ready to roll. <laughs> Sophie's like, I'm not awake yet. Anyway, we got them all on. They got the ride on, early morning ride. And Stella wants to go. Let her go, let that girl go. So she shouldn't really have any feet problems anymore in terms of sore and trying to walk on her tippy toes. Gabby's just trotting along here. Here's Gabby's practicing her collected trot. Collected trot, everybody. You are now being judged <laughs> by 40,000 people. <laughs> I cracked myself up. <laughs> You're all being judged. <laughs> Come on, Miss Stella. Oh, Come on, Miss Stella. Stella. She's going uphill. She's like, I can't make it. There goes Storm. And a collision. And a spook. And another spook. And I don't know what's wrong with her today. Yes, you can have a walk break. <laughs> All walk. Except for the girl over there on the, on the dark bay because she doesn't listen. Instead of vlogging and watching you struggle, can I help you? You want out one of these? No, she just goes back. She needs a whoa whip. <laughs> she needs a whoa. Okay, stop, stop, stop. Just let her go. So you want her to gallop away? Yeah, let her gallop. No. <laughs> Joking, I'm watching. I'm watching now, Sophie. She just wants to go. She wants to be like everybody else. Sophie, if you let her go, she's gonna lose more weight because she's working more. My girlfriend's saying, I wanna jump the jump. What? Reverse on the rail, everybody. Reverse on the rail. Except for the girl on the black and white cow. Do you want Gabby to get on her for a minute? Gabby, will you ride Stella for a minute and get all the all the early morning sass out of her? It's because we haven't ridden her in a few days. Sure. I should have lunched her first. Yeah, we should have done something, but we didn't know she'd be sassy. We didn't even know she had a sassy bone in her. Okay, you guys going to switch ponies? Yeah. All right, let's do it. There we go. I don't know why she's... Whoa. She is running away. Is she doing that all on her own? Wow. Is she doing it on her own? You asked her to trot? She's like, I have not been able to move this fast in so long. Poor Sophie. You just have to get used to her. It's hard to stay on? What? Yeah, she goes at the, at the touch of anything. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Poor girl. She won't listen? Yeah, she listens to everything you say. Like if she even thinks, like she's going to be one of those horses if somebody else clicks, she's going to go. Yeah, I don't know if that horse is going to be too fast for us. 
Is she trotting? Is that trotting or is that? She's it's not like a normal trot. She wants to go faster? Yeah, she would gallop away. Oh my god, what the heck. Honeymoon period is over. There's going to be a learning curve with Miss Stella. Learning curve with Miss Stella, right? Yep. Storm's like, this is my speed. Let's just sit here. Definitely learned that there's a transition when you get a new horse. It's a bit of a, a, a time when you have to figure out each other. Are you ready for it to switch? Yes. Sophie, do you think you can handle her now? She's fast. She's That's the kind of walk she has to do. You just sit down and hold on. Yeah, we have to just get used to that. That's all. We just have to get used to her. She's definitely more forward. Yeah, she looks good now. Let's let her go. Uh-oh, here comes Ben. Ben over a jump. Whoa. All right, go ahead. You see that? Sophie's like, and she's like, perks her ears, and she's like, let's go, pretty girl. Look how pretty those eyes are. That's what Sophie's comfortable with. <laughs> That's the thing. When you get a new horse, it sets you back so far. Like, Gabby got set back from Storm so far. Yeah, um, I was jumping when I used to have, as, when I used to ride Azzy, I was jumping the wall tops, no problem. And I even started on oxen. And then, um, Azzy got too skinny and I couldn't ride him, so I moved to Ben and I was all the way back down to starting at poles and going up. Yeah, isn't that weird how that happens? Yeah, and then... I have to restart with Azzy doing oxen. Yeah, and it's but I saw that you started to do that. I... Yeah, right, little Miss Princess is like, oh, I got the bridge. I wonder why she didn't want to do it that one day. Oh, no, she loves it. Now she loves it, yeah, she's taking you to it. Let's, let's go to the bridge. She's got such a funny body, like she's so short, legged or something. I mean, it's good for them to just walk around and practice while well, Sophie gets used to it. Maybe all this walking will help Sophie get used to the feel of her and she won't have to suffer too much of the setback. She is fast. <laughs> She's like, let's do it! That's what they do in this, at this barn. They swap ponies. Feels good, I bet, Chloe. No? <laughs> and then little Molly on Big Ben. And there's the donkey. You are now being judged. Oh, everybody trot, please. Just regular trot. Oh, Sophie's got it. Good job, Sophia. Pull on her face too much. Yes. Collected trot.
collected trot. You guys pick the winner. Our subscribers are gonna pick the winner. Our subscribers are gonna pick the winner. Collected trot. Is that what you guys are doing now, collected trot? You're doing extended? Okay, extended trot. Okay, go in the middle. Wow, extended trot is fast. That's pretty much what I do every single time when my horse won't canter. You guys are picking the winner. Please excuse the new pony in the middle. <laughs> Sitting trot. Stella wants to go over that jump, I'm telling ya. Okay, walk and reverse. Walk for a whole round though. Oh, okay. Everybody, okay, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm gonna get better at this. I didn't get any of the reverses. Walk with a loose rein. She's getting used to her pony and her pony's getting used to her. She is so not bouncing. Oh, good. I think if I buy girth that she likes, it'll be a little better. Okay, trot. Ooh, almost a collision. Sitting trot. Good girl, Sophia. Bounce, 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 bounce. That's what Gabby did with Storm. Always kept slowing him down every time he went going because she was nervous. Extended trot. So extended trot is faster. I'm gonna find some good pony club activities for us to do. Collected trot. Is collected trot like a regular trot? Oh, Ben, you look pretty. You should get a practice getting his head down, Gabby. Yes. That's a good little walk. That's a good walk. Keep her that walking. No, that's walking. I don't know. She looks like she's walking. What do I have to say? Pan gallop, working canter, and collecting canter. Canter, please. Okay. Hand gallop. Look at him go. Like you want to move out of the way. And he's galloping. When he's going. <laughs> Holy cow. 
What's the other one? Collected? Canter? Hope that's a thing. I have no idea. I don't know what any of them mean. I know they're teaching me as they go. <laughs> All right, everybody walk, and the judges will compile their results and let us know in the comments below. So Stella does not like bug spray because she doesn't like the spray. So we have this Canadian bees wax stuff, and I rubbed it all over her body because it's citronella, and it's citronella scented, and it will keep all the bugs off of her, and we don't have to spray it. Also, I wanted to tell you, this is one of the things, I'm going to make a video, all the things I love, the equestrian things I love. I think we're going to do that video this week. Look how cute she is. Look how cute she is. Mom, um, I need you to carry this down. Oh, right. Girls are citronella. It's uh, citronella beeswax. Mom, so, please grab this for me. Yeah. So girls are getting on in the arena and they're going to ride down. Some people want to know, how do you make your lead rope into a... I'll you. Okay, Molly's gonna show us. Molly, you have your lead rope. You unclip it. You put it through, and then you. Oh, but it has to it be on. knotted at the end. Or yeah, and yes. it has to be knotted at the end, happen. otherwise it'll just fall through. And then they whip it up over top of his head, like and this. like this. Watch the pro. Yeah, yeah. and then instant trail ride. Bareback yeah. trail ride. Oh, um, Sophie said that this one is too thick. It won't work. Yeah. Molly had a little fall, bruised her tailbone. Mom. Thank goodness your mom walked in. Yeah. All right, yeah. let's move out. Can you please? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Mom, can you please walk? With yes, I'm coming to walk with you. I just sweep this whole floor, and I have to sweep it again. I'm coming up. I'm coming up. I can't squeeze with my legs. <laughs> you can't squeeze with your legs. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Ah, ah, ah. So I feel like what she's doing today is all about her friends. I feel like. So we need to do some. I feel like she likes bitless. Mom. I feel like she likes All right. Let's go then. And that's a wrap, ladies. Sophie's first time riding bareback on Stella. She's a bit nervous. And as you can see, Stella's like, I'm coming! I'm gonna save you! With my broken foot! Okay, hold on, Stella. Stella. Hey. Slow down, Missy. Mom, you're turning her to eat grass. You need to catch up. Well, I can't walk as fast as a horse. I have a broken foot. You're just going to have to deal, Soph. And I think you can. She's just a fast walker. It's good for you, good for her. Just get used to it. So, hop along Laura with the broken foot and, <laughs> and Stella is in the lead. And Sophie's getting used to it, thank goodness. Yeah, she's a fast pony, she's a fast horse. Oh, I need to be riding, you guys. I need my own horse so I can be riding. Okay, <laughs> so they all stopped where they're supposed to stop to dismount. But Stella's going to the barn. <laughs> She's, <laughs> Sophie's like, Mom, I am coming. I have a broken foot. I am not, I'm not the right person to be in charge here today. Stop, Stella. Pull on her. I think we need a different, uh, there you go. Uh-oh. Nope, she's going to the barn. <laughs> this is not good for my broken foot. Huh. Stella, stop it. <laughs> Stella. Stella. Bad girl. Come on. Come over on the side and help me down. Stop. She's hungry. 
All right, so horses. He, I'm already heat stroked, you guys. Mom, you go in there first. Oh, because of the dark? No, because there's something dead in there. There's something dead in here? Where? There's a live horsey there. I'm not in love with dead things. Where's the dead thing? The cat's alive. I'm glad you're alive, Hendrix. All right, you guys, let's find a dead thing. Where is it? Look at a dead bunny. A dead bunny? <gasps> oh! I need to text that to somebody. It's not a dead bunny. It's a ripped open bag of grain. That's the raccoon did it. You, you made me think there was a dead bunny. You're such a pretty girl. So some things to work on with Stella. Fiona will help us figure out how to get her past that. Today she said, Anna, you're not the boss of me, so we need to do some join up, join up and some liberty once the weather changes. Come on, let's go. We're going to put all the horses in. It looked like <laughs> the I dead wish buddy. Maybe it was right beside her. Rogan goes next to Tex. Yeah, cool. Yeah, cool. The kitty's like, look at, look at what happened. He's sitting there showing us. He's like, somebody did it. It was a raccoon, huh? Stella, <laughs> she's like, <laughs> I'm in hay. Maybe it was the grass we gave her too. Or maybe um, she was starving. Yeah, she could have been starving. And saying, let's get this over with, I need to eat. Or she just wanted to go to Nikki. Yeah. <laughs> That's she does seem a little unsettled. You know why? Because she hasn't got her grain yet. Usually when she comes in, her grain is in here. She's like, give me the grain. She's... What color is that it's a bag of grain. Oh. <laughs> it comes as he wears storm. Oh. All right, well, let's go get the rest of them in. Rogan goes beside Sto uh, Tex. Yeah, it was a raccoon. Right there. Right there. That's the dead bunny. No. I better clean it up though. All right, let's go get some ponies. Oh, some ponies. We're putting them all in. Oh. Come on, let's go. Come on, Sophie. We can do it. They're like, let's go in. Oh my goodness. So Nikki is like the mean girl in the group. And Stella has joined herself to the mean girl group. And Storm is starting to get uh, comfortable with Grace, the new girl. Hello. Right, here she goes. Don't push me into the fence. I better go over on this side. Jesus! <laughs> there we go. Go lock her in! Uh-oh. Do not like it when they go running. Oh, yeah. She's in there. Oh, she needs some fly spray. They're eating you alive, girly. Oh my goodness. That's ridiculous. It's the most flies I've ever seen here. You're good, pretty. You're okay. Yes, we know Nikki tried to run you off. But you're okay. We'll keep you safe. There's some fly spray in there, but you can't put it on her face, but. Okay, I'm gonna put this on because I don't know her yet. But... Alright, question of the day. Is it harder to put weight on a horse or take weight off? I'm thinking put weight on because that's what works for me. Yeah. Yeah, Gabby, you want to walk her? Yeah, I'm like half broken and petrified. Yeah. <laughs> she's half broken because she fell on her butt and she's petrified. Just being honest. Half broken and half petrified. Or fully petrified. Oh, I better close that gate. Oh, yeah. Okay. You don't want any dad's yelling. Good. She just needed to get the hang of it. So that little girl, Grace, is owned by a 13-year-old. And the 13-year-old also camps at our campground. Gabby and her spent the whole afternoon yesterday in the pool hanging out. Same. And Sophie riding the bull. Are you hot? Guys, it is scorching. Here's, um, 
Yeah, I'll bring in Tex. He's like, bring me. Yes. Throw it on him for me. Is... Okay, I'll grab Barry. Okay, I'm coming too. Mom, Storm was excited. Right. This is Rogan. You boy. Do you, you guys boy. love Seth Rogan? I love Seth Rogan. <laughs> you boy. Right, there goes Blue. Bye, Blue. Oh, hope it's Blue is a Percheron cross, you guys. So he is a big bodied horse. Yep. Can, I can, do that one? can you do what? They're wild. You want to do the wild group? Mm -hmm. No. Journey? Look at there's a whole sea of chestnuts here. A whole sea field. of chestnuts. This is the chestnut field, also known as the wild field. And they're not wild really, they just want to eat. Okay, so is uh, Hope going in on her own? Yeah. What about that horse in the back? There's Wiser and there's Millhouse. So I need to go in and get Millhouse? And Wiser. Wiser will. Okay, let's do it. Rub it in. No, she's more pale than Molly. See, look, mine. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you guys a little interesting story about Romeo the bird here. He's still here. He's anxious to get out. He's gonna be getting out for a short period soon. Um, he still wants me to feed him though. He's like, I give him his food in the bottom of his cage and he's like, no, put it in my mouth. I'm like, no, eat it yourself. Anyways, I was editing at the table the other day and I looked out and there was a bit, there's a little starling sitting on my deck, just like a regular, it looked exactly like him, but so skinny. I looked at that starling, I looked at my starling, I'm like, you're so fat. Like, he's, he's fat, you guys. You're too healthy. You ate too much food. He's like, who you call him fat? <laughs> He's so cute though. Oh, okay. Back at the pool and and we have Molly's here. <laughs>
and don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.